Christianity as a whole hinges off this one truth, the resurrection of Jesus. And I know a lot of people say, well, no, I just can't believe that. I just don't know if that's true. Not knowing what you're about to hear right now. Watch this. I used to think as an atheist that the resurrection was a legend and that took a long time to develop in the ancient world. But what I learned is that we have preserved for us a creed of the earliest Christian church, a eyewitness-based report of the resurrection of Jesus. Now this creed has been dated back by scholars to within months of the death of Jesus. Within months, that is historical gold. So we've got a news flash from ancient history on the resurrection. Third category of evidence is the empty tomb. And the best evidence for that is even the opponents of Jesus implicitly admitted the tomb was empty. Because when the disciples began proclaiming that Jesus had risen, what the opponents said was, oh, well, um, the disciples stole the body. Now they're conceding the tomb's empty, they're just trying to explain how it got empty. So everybody's conceding the tomb was empty. How did it get empty is really the issue, and that goes to the fourth category of evidence, which is eyewitnesses.